Hi, in this video I will show you how to implement Archery module into Base Dynamic Combat System. I'm on Unreal Engine 5.2. On the left side I have Mel Combat System and on the right side this is Archery Park. Okay, so uh, first thing we need to do is to copy this Archery module folder into our Base Dynamic Combat System. So let's open in it Explorer and let's simply copy this one and paste it in here and this will give us access to all the files that are required by Archery. Uh, now we only need to update a couple of functions and animations. So let's start with animation blueprint combat character. Uh, it's being used by player and AI characters. Okay and here we need to copy a couple of uh, setups from animation layers. So let's start with ground locomotion. Let's copy this both. Paste it in here. And we also need to connect it with archery pose. It means that the, the, those animations will be used when a player will be in archery combat style. Okay, now let's also copy animations from aiming layer okay and that's all we have to do in animation blueprint now let's move to BP combat character this is blueprint used by player and in here we need to copy this whole graph so I will copy it and paste it in here and basically that's all uh, we had to do we had to take from archery packs so i can now uh, maximize this one and, and start working on this so let's compile and you will get a bunch of errors and to fix them you have to press file refresh all nodes and there is still one error that you will get and that's uh, because of naming so we have to replace this timeline with timeline zero uh, that that's the one you could basically also do it uh, by connecting it like this so play it as you wish and now we need to update a um, couple couple of function calls in few places so let's type in archery update in find result tab and if you don't have this tab you can find it under window find results Okay, now let's go through each, each of these comments and we have to call proper functions based on the command name. Okay, here we need to select what montages player will use when uh, while he will be in uh, archery combat style. So this would be player archery okay after doing that we only need to update uh, equipment and inventory components so in equipment we need to add another main hand type which would be range weapon and this will allow us to switch between metal weapon which could be sword axe to range weapon uh, which in, uh, in this case would be a bow and let's also add a couple of items that we will use and also some arrows Okay, and now if I pr play the game, I can change my item in equipment and I should already be able to use them. But I don't have any uh, visual representation of what range weapon is currently equipped uh, in here. So let's fix it. And this is widget, widget blueprint active equipment slots. 
in here you can find this uh, range weapon slot and it's by default it's hidden so let's uh, uncheck this eye icon and let's also change its visibility from hidden to this one can we can position it as as we wish uh, this icon stands for melee weapon this one is range weapon so now if i play the game and i equip any bow and arrows okay i should i'm, I'm able to see what what um, bow is currently equipped but i'm still not able to see what arrows do we have so let's also fix that and for that we have uh, another slot which is called arrow slot so let's do the same uh, what we did for range weapon okay and right now i'm seeing uh, bow and arrows i can switch arrows with x key all keys are available under uh, key okay as, as you can see it works perfectly so that's the whole process of merging the, those packs that we can also test uh, ai let's simply drop him into the level Okay, and that's all. Thanks for watching.